If you're in the market for a truck, well, listen up. The Wildlife Department will be auctioning off 34 surplus vehicles to the public March 12th at our headquarters in Oklahoma City. Most are late model, four-wheel drive, extended cab pickups, but there are a couple cars as well. Go to wildlifedepartment.com for a complete list, including pictures of all the vehicles, and then plan to come to the auction on the 12th. March is traditionally the beginning of the annual paddlefish run in Oklahoma, and if you're planning on getting in on the action, be aware of new regulations. Mondays and Fridays are catch and release days only statewide. Also, the Spring River is closed from the Highway 60 bridge upstream to the state line. Snagging is also closed on the Grand River from the Highway 412 bridge upstream to the Markham Ferry Dam between 10 p.m. and 6 a.m. year-round. For additional information about paddle fishing in Oklahoma, log on to wildlifedepartment.com today. If you need a paddle fishing permit for this spring, did you know that you can go to wildlifedepartment.com and print one off for free? Hello, I'm Don P. Brown, Associate Editor of Outdoor Oklahoma Magazine. Lots of folks enjoy getting outside with their cameras to document nature's beauty and wonder. And I'm one of them. And you might be too. Occasionally you might capture that really awesome shot of a wild critter, a bird, a flower, or a natural scene that is truly remarkable. Why not share those special images with us? Each year, Outdoor Oklahoma is pleased to showcase dozens of fine photos captured by you. Our annual Reader's Photography Showcase issue is filled with the beauty of Oklahoma's natural world as seen through the camera lenses of our faithful readers. This issue is always among our most popular. Just think of the pride you'll feel when you see one or more of your creations printed in a high-quality, award-winning magazine. I'd like to invite you to submit up to five of your best digital images. It's easy to do online. Just Go to our website, wildlifedepartment.com, fill out the entry form, then rename and attach up to five photo files. Complete instructions are included with the entry form. The best of the best will be selected for publication in this year's Outdoor Oklahoma Reader's Photography Showcase. But be sure to enter before the deadline of April 15th. I'm looking forward to seeing your wonderful photos. Good luck. Check out more news of the week at wildlifedepartment.com.